not agree with you. I <laughs> guess <laughs> 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 how she presents things. I found that as well. <laughs> yes, but so I know what you all do, and I think this is kind of something that we see, this kind of a tendency that we see today, right? It's kind of criticize binaries, criticize object, uh, subject object division and kind of trying to, 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 to point to kind of a third way of interdependencies, right, foam, um, or like a critical theory of technology that kind of tries to, um, to mediate both. Um, my question is whether you can say more about mediation and synthesis, because I'm not sure that, and bring it into dialogue with uh, the book, because I'm, I'm, I have the sense that there are some tensions, because this kind of critical theory that both of you are proposing, and also Raev, I think, you know, the kind of responsibility, I'm not sure whether it is kind of going against this notion of synthesis, the Hegelian against. against, yes, because you are in oh. your, whether you can say maybe more, about the notion of responsibility, right? This kind of third space of thinking. At least in, in an Orentian understanding, it is tied to action. Action, like, you know, in common, but of course, as the form of newness, right? And the form of Natalia and freedom. That actually is not Hegelian, I would, I would say. <laughs> so let me kind of maybe um, introduce the Kant Hegel divide here a little bit <laughs> and and ask you to, to, to say more about what you mean with, with the third, the third space, maybe humanity's you know grasping the, like the ambiguous, um, the foam interdependencies, right? And also the kind of critical theory of technology that you have in mind. Each of the speakers is ready to say something? 